back to my let's play of The Witch 3 Wild Hunt. In the last episode we did the practicum of advanced alchemy. Uh, we had to get a few things for Gremist and get is it Fritty off to come and visit. Basically they got pissed. And that's all they did. They sat in his little cave and got pissed. So yeah. Uh, I had a look at what he's got and I bought a couple of things but not much and I was only able to make one oil so uh, I'll have a quick what other look see if he's got I taught you all I know anything that we're looking for the uh, mandrake cordial I forgot to have a look for that got anything to sell uh, okay. but it's expensive so I'll just have a quick look I don't think he does no he doesn't right that's fine so let's play Gwen. Gwent? Ever play the game? If your question is, would I be interested in playing you? The answer is simple. No. Come on, Gremist. Afraid of losing? I understand. Very well. I drive your deck. Gwen, I'll give you my best card. Cool. That'll do. Get it in there. Right, I think we're just going to play with what we've got, because... We don't have all that much, so yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll just go straight in. Oh, it's playing Nilfgaard, so we could have spies flying around again. Uh, all right, so we've got clear weather, Commander's Horn, a spy, one blue stripe, medic, and Triss, and a catapult. So yeah, it's pretty crap. Uh, we'll swap out Vesemir. For death mold, fine. Trebuchet for another commander's hall. Uh, all right, now let's see what we can do, shall we? Right, so usual start. Let's get deep in. I play a spy. So we've got our other cap that capital catapult, uh, which is good, and we've got a Grimford Reaver. Uh, okay, so what we'll do is we'll play our blue stripe. We can always bring that back. Opponent has passed. So we need a. Alright, so we won't be bringing our blue stripe back. That'll do. We will bring our catapult back at some point. Okay, so we got Natalis. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so we'll start with our Grimford Reaver, because seeing as though we're not getting any more cards. Yeah, I don't think we're going to win this. Uh, let's play our Ballista. Triss, you're up. Does that mean we've got three Commander's Horns? Really? Uh, I don't know whether to just let him take me around, you know. Uh, I'm gonna play my no. I'm gonna play Death Mold. Right, I thought that was gonna happen, which is really annoying. I don't think we're gonna win this. This is gonna be one of my first defeats, I think. Because he's bound to have Scorch in there as well. really going to put a dampener on things. Right, let's play Natalis. Yeah, this isn't looking great. Uh, 
Right, I've got a plate, a commander's horn on my front row here. I know it's only worth four. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, see, I don't play me catapult. You know, just in case he has got a scorch. Oh, sod it. Go on, I'm in. Hmm, okay. Uh, right, let's just see if he has got a scorch then, shall we? Let's play that other commander's horn then, in here. Oh, what do I do? What have we got in here? Our blue stripe, or our catapult. Get eight for our blue stripe, which takes us up to eighty-three. If we lose that sixteen, still brings us down to sixty-seven. So I'm wondering if it's worth not bothering the catapult, just in case he has that scorch. I'm bringing the blue stripe because that's protected. In fact, I think that is what I'm going to do. I am. Oh, I forgot that's... Right, so that would be, if I played that, another 16, plus another 32, so another 48 on there, but we're going to lose 48, that's 93, 133, sod it, yeah, we'll still win. I think, even if he has got a scorch. There we go, jobs are good. What was I saying about I don't think we can win this? You won. I believe you're ready to challenge Madman Lugos. I do wonder if he'll agree to play you for his catacan. We shall see, shall we? Oh, mysterious elf. Oh. That is a proper card. This is the ultimate spy. No strength. Can't be taken off the board. With a decoy or anything like that. It is just superb. Okay. Right. So what we're going to go and do is we're going to go to Lugos. Oh no, we've got another game as well. We've got one in care trolled. So let's do that. Hang on. Did I just click? Yeah, I did. I thought I'd put it on the wrong one. Right. So let's go to Catch Hold and go and see this other one. We might pop to the inn as well. See if they've got any Mandrake Cordial in there. We might do that first actually. We've also got our stash here, so I think what we'll do is we'll go in here first. Go and pop our stuff in the stash. I 
I don't know if to just keep carrying these around, you know. And just feel all heavy armour. I think we'll just flog that. There's a few things we need to flog, actually. I'm just going to keep carrying my uh, Richard Swords around. Right, let's speak to the innkeeper. Greetings, I'm Geralt. The Witcher known as the White Wolf, I know. They tell stories about you every day around here. Do they really? <coughs> Excuse me. I'll be fine. Just wanted to talk. Uh, show me your words. What oh, smells so delicious? Oh, look at all them. He's got 17 of the buggers. Right, we'll take all these. And this isn't going to cost a fortune. I'm taking the lot. So long. Thanks for sparing a moment. No, not inventory. Alchemy. White gull. And we can use them all bar one. And I'm gonna... Yeah, it's all getting used. All this white gull. And hopefully we won't, we won't need much else. Right, this oils, these oils. We need a vermilion. Ether. Albedo. And Rubido. And I bet I can't remember them. Albedo. We're short on ether. Oh, we're short on quite a bit of stuff. I know I can go and make that oil, but we'll go to the herbalist on our way back. What's this? Oh, hell. Greetings, Simon. Lugas decided to let you go. Nay, it was me decided to leave. Time's come to settle some scores. And you're gonna help me. Oh, I am, am I? A favour for a favour, remember? You owe me a debt. Pay it, or cover you and your whole line with shame. Okay. Uh, what is it? Gotta tell me what it's about first. And I say you needn't know. It's honour, mind you, to do what I say. Do whatever I fancy asking you. Okay, uh, fine. What do you, what do I have to do? My line doesn't have too rosy a future anyway. But never mind that. What do I do? There's a lake here on Ard Skellig near Blandair. A lone hut on its shore. We'll meet there. It's where I tell you what comes next. Don't tarry long, or you'll have me thinking you're trying to weasel out. And you don't want Simon Branding to be thinking that. Okay. An unpaid debt. Right, that's the guy who gave us information to get us out of uh, prison. We serve her who is virgin, mother and crone. Okay, let's... Uh... Oh, he's here. Schuster. Greetings. Smooth seas this morn. As if the gods themselves were paying their respects to the great Konung Bran. You a tailor? I am. Only one in the Isles, most like. Uh, yeah, let's have a look at your goods, son. Gladly look at what you got. Wise man. No common rags among my wares. Uh, yeah. Not much, really. It is pretty much common rags. Yeah. Alright. Bye. Let's put
suppose I could sell him some of my uh Any chance you play what's it? Uh oh, pelts. It's a great passion. Wanna play? Uh sure. I'm ready. Let's do this. Right, oh, I put Mysterious Elf in, didn't I? So, that's good. So, yeah, let's just go for it, shall we? Ooh, what's that? What's his leader? Oh, we've got a couple of spies with our Mysterious Elf and Prince Stennis, a Grinford Reaver, two catapults, Natalis and Tyson. Good old Estorads here. Uh, yeah, okay. I don't know whether to just go with this, actually. I'm thinking, yeah, I'm thinking I'll just go with that's it. I might swap out with Trebuchet, though. Yeah. Which was pretty stupid, really. Okay, we'll go with that. This is a bit more on the front line, though, instead of being all in the back. Oh, great. Right, we'll play Prince Dennis first. So if he decides he's going to take that, then that's fine. Oh, we've got Dijkstra as well. That is even better. I could really do with another decoy. Yeah, I thought he'd be coming back. Uh, okay. So we've got another Crimford Reaver there as well. And a medic, which is great. Uh, we'll play our mysterious elf friend. And we've got Yennefer. So we have two our... Uh, well, try again. We have both our medics. And then we will... Bring this Prince Stennis back. And we'll play him as well. Oh, we got Siri and another blue stripe. Opponent has passed. Is that really a good idea? Do we just play the two cards and win it? Play our blue stripe. Uh, uh, Quinn's Retrievers because we can bring them back. You know, I think that's the plan here. It's a plan. Oh, it doesn't work like that, does it? Oh, Andrew, you idiot. Oh, Andrew, you complete idiot. You're going to have to play your Commander Sword as well. Damn, you complete pilchard. Oh well, that's fine. I don't mind, not really. <sighs> I could have just played me too. Oh no, I'd still have to play a third card. I was going to say I could have just played me two cat catapults, but that only takes me to 32. So I would have had to have played a third card anyway. Right, okay, let's uh, play Vesemir to start with, I think. Oh, Yennefer straight out, here comes a spy. Okay, let's play our uh, trebuchet. And I didn't check what his leader did, did I? Scorch, marvellous. Destroy your enemy's strongest siege units. If the combined strength of all his or her siege units is 10 or more. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. I'm going to have to... Uh, mess around a bit with our what's it I think catapults go on Esterad I 
God, these are some hefty cards going in. Okay, Natalis, you're up next. So there's two in it now. I could sneak him in because Film Threaten Mirth's not going to do anything. So wait a minute, it's just going to get rid of Prince Dennis. Which could be helpful. Okay, let's play Roach. Okay, let's pop in our other blue stripe then. As soon as it's covered by theirs. Right, now I'm going to have to mess with our catapults. As I put these in, he's just going to blitz them with his. Uh, uh, go on, his leader ability, and then I can just bring him straight back here. Unless he's got a Scorch, that is, which I will not be happy about for his last card. Nope. That's good. Oh. Okay, might as well, just to rub it in a bit. More than double this score. Cool. Congratulations. Right, okay, so it's a case of off to see Madman Lugos. New item, Yevin. Okay. Right, we'll just pop in and see our herbalist. Would you like to buy something from the stash? Too, too right, I would. Maybe. Let me see what you got. This is going to take a bit of doing, I think. Do you have green mould? Yes, you do. I think we only need one. Right, let's make the superior hybrid oil. What was it that needed the green mould? Oh, it must have been that that needed the green mould. Right, Rubido. Oh no, I think I need green mold for it also. So what was it? Rubido Ether Cubrith Vermilion Rubido Vermilion and Ether Ergot seeds. Oh, we'll just buy a few. Rubido, what was it? Yes, it was. What was the other one? Was it Vermilion? I can't remember what it was now, it's gone. Well, we'll soon find out anyway. There we go. Right. I think that's not far off all our oils at Superior, you know. Right, so what do we need here? We need Vermilion again. Let's 
to appear or we need enhanced right honey don't we first oh no we already have enhanced right honey right superior white honey is vitriol right, superior thunderbolt is cubrith Oh, so I need another two cubrith to get those, that's fine. Right, I can do one more superior cat ether. Right, okay. That will do nice. So long. Right, was there something else I was going to do? I can't remember now. Right, let's go and see Lugos. Good old madman. Who is right down here somewhere. At Kermio. There we go. Hello, madman. Go see your friend Croc if you want to talk. Oh, he's not happy. Uh, how, how was your relationship with Croc? Two clans on one island. Tough to be neighbors so near each other. A neighbor is one who lives nearby, not one who stole half your home. The Ancrete seized our lands. In the days of Harold the Cripple, that was three centuries ago. Doesn't change the fact they had no right. I'll rid Art Skelling of Crack and his brood yet. Uh, yeah, why exactly are you called Madman? Just out of curiosity, why do they call you Madman? Yeah! Really? Okay. Uh, how about a game of Gwent then? Gwent? Know the game? The gull shed off clips. Let's see your duck. It's been a dull day. We'll play for my catacomb. Uh, sure, okay. Show me what you can do. You know, I keep forgetting to put my scorch in. I've just noticed. Okay. Let's start. Please, biting frost, please. Oh, I've got a scorch, but no biting frost. Uh, two blue strides, Clandus Horn, Fezimir, Yennefer, Triss, and Geralt. Okay, so we'll swap out Fezimir for our mysterious elf, that's grand. What about our blister? Sod it, go for it. Hmm, okay. Mysterious elf, you're up. Please give me a biting frost. No, but I've got another spy. So I'll play Dijkstra. Two Commander's Horns again. Oh, he's coming straight out with his uh, vampires. That suits me fine. See, is that his catacan near? Yeah, it is, and that just puts it so all these other ones are out from Scorch. I mean, if that wasn't near, with one, two, three, four, five, gone, just like that. But we have a five card advantage now. But where do we go? 
mean, again, I could play two normal cards just so we have them in our discard pile. In fact, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to play my Crimford Reaver. Oh, fine, that gets that out of the way as well. Cool. And then we'll play a catapult as well. Oh, you can keep playing. I don't mind. Right, I'm not even going to try and match that. If I had a Biting in Frost, I'd just put it down and go for it, but I haven't, unfortunately. I don't know how we're going to do this. Opponent's passed. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll just play Triss, because she's not really got anything special apart from she can't be scorched or anything. And we get another card back, so hopefully Biting Frost, but I doubt it. A decoy. Oh, oh, oh no, that's no use, really. Uh, I suppose it is as a throwaway, like our leader ability as well. That could be used as a throwaway. Right, I'm going straight in with Geralt. Showing my mean business. Natalis, you're up as well. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to play one of my blue stripes, just in case he's got a villain threat on Mirth. I'll do it now. Or however it's pronounced, I've got no idea, but... Okay. I mean, it could be worth scorching it. Getting it scorched. Because we can bring him back. Which is going to be worth more than the catapult and the Crimford Reaver if it is. So it might be an idea. But even so, it's still not. I could really do with that Crimford Reaver. Just so one of me Commander's Horns has got something to work on. But what I am going to do is I'm going to use my Scorch, even now, because I just want to use it. I don't want to waste it. Or I could use my decoy. No, yeah, I'm going to use my decoy to bring back this. And then, because I've only got the two cards in there that I can bring back, so it's pointless having the decoy to use. Uh, okay, let's put... Popping back in, he'll, he'll be wondering what the hell I'm doing here. And you, sorry, you probably. But I don't want to play my blue stripe yet. Right, okay, we'll play our Dun Banner Medic and bring back our Crimford Reaver, I think. has passed. Lovely, we got it in the bag again. See, now what I'd do is I'd play this. Bring back my catapult. Oh, I didn't play my score, should I? Oh well. There you go. Four times his score. That'll do nicely. Right, 
Right, okay. But then they'd say Lugos had gone even madder. Take my katakana sword off. Okay, I will. Right, so what I'm thinking we do now is uh, not go to the Isle of Mists yet. Uh, but I go and do this Simon rambling thing, an unpaid debt. Which is going to be pretty much a doddle, I'd have thought. But the way I play it, maybe not. So we'll head back to Blandera. Or Blandara. Jump on Roach, who should be right next to the uh, signpost, pretty much. Hi, girl. And see what we've got here. See what he's got for us to do to repay his debt. Oh, re repay our debt to him, I should say. Come here, Simon. You were thick brambling, but that thick to waltz into me. What the hell's this? Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. He's come to kill ye. What? What did he do to you, Simon? Me? To him? Twas him who did me wrong. Horse son killed me brother. Tricked him. Betrayed him. I swore revenge. Hunted him across all the isles. Bugger always got away somehow. True now, that is. High time we end this strife. Once and for all, no more questions, Garrett. Cut him down! Uh, no. Out of the question. I'm no murderer. Out of the question, Simon. I'm no murderer. Not gonna kill him. Then you'll die. Oh, I will, will I? <laughs> nice one, pal. For a minute there. For a minute, I thought you'd do it. Thought you'd kill me. Oh, I thought about it. Uh, yeah, I've got a different notion of honour than... Oh, I don't know about that. For a minute there, so did I. For a minute there, so did I. I owed him no two ways about it. He helped me escape from prison. Tell no one what happened here, Witcher. Simon's got a spear-side cousin on Speaker Rock. He learns what you've done here. He'll vow blood revenge. Won't rest till... Enough. Not another word about pride, feuds, or bonds of kinship. You can kill each other without my help from now on. Yeah. Right. So, what we're gonna do now is, I think, is we're going to go to the Isle of Mists. We're gonna go find a boat. That's it, Roach. So, where is our closest boat? Uh, Van Vig, I think. And where are we going? Yeah, so... Let's just go around the lake. And see what we have. Yeah, finally gonna go and find Siri. Ooh, wild horses. Why am I steering? Oh. 
Oh, let's run into the boat. Why not? Now here's a lovely one. Not like my uh, uh, where's the boat? Where is the boat? Or did we take this one? We may have taken this one. Somewhere else. I think we did. Damn. See, that's why you should always park a boat where you found it. Right, let's try somewhere else then, shall we? We've got to catch Old Harbour. And find a boat down here. Ooh, that was close. We'll take this one. Uh, before we go there as well, we have a load of points to spend and another slot which I forgot all about. So, what are we going to go into? That is the other question. Refreshment. Each portion dose imbibed heals 5% of maximum vitality. Ooh, that could be nice. Protective coating adds 5% protection against attacks from the monster type the oil targets. Tissue transmutation. When consumed, mutagen decoctions decrease increases maximum vitality by 200 points for decoctions effective duration. Okay. And your pain increases maximum vitality by 10% when toxicity exceeds the safe threshold. If toxicity is above zero, time automatically slows when an enemy is about to form a counter attack. Yeah. See, I'm wondering if it's worth going into strength training. Or is it worth saving these five and putting back in our griffin school techniques? I'm, I don't know. I'm really not sure where to go here. Uh, increases out of range by three yards. Alternate sign mode art strikes all opponents in a certain radius, knockdown chances 21% lower. But does that go to the same percentage if I go all the way? Because it looks like level 2 will be 14, level 3, 7. Or will it be 10 and 0? In which case, I'm going to put it instead of the normal art. You know, it might be worth taking a look at that actually. Uh, okay, let's try it anyway. And then we'll put in. Our Griffin school gear. Alternate sewing mode. Arch strikes all opponents in a certain radius. Yeah, so it's basically spot on. It's exactly the same as that, but in a radius. It may not be quite as far reaching, but. And we've still got the normal one. Okay, right, let's head out to the Isle of Mists. Right, let's see if we can fast travel. I think we can to quite close by. That we can.
Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Right, okay, we need to be adding. Oh, let's go around this way, shall we? Right, let's go. Oh, we've got sirens over there. I'm not bothered at all at the minute. Unless they decide to attack me. Which isn't far beyond the bounds of possibility. We're heading for this archway, I think. That one. Oh, it's getting misty. Getting misty. Right, okay, you are nearing a crucial point in the game's story. It is recommended you save your game in a manual slave slot now. Well, I will be doing that. And we will also be taking a break here. And then we will go to the Isle of Miss in the next episode. So until then, thank you very much for watching and goodbye.